So if anyone hasn't watched the Fair Oaks Farms undercover investigation video yet, I definitely recommend that you go check it out. Um, but if you don't know, it's the largest investigation that's been done of a dairy organization in history. And in the video, they show a lot of the workers beating male baby calves and kicking them and just doing a bunch of horrific things. And then it also shows the workers being trained and how they're told to drive around back if they have dead cows on their trucks. Um, and then it also talks about how this specific dairy organization tried to claim that they didn't send their um, male baby cows to veal, but then they saw all of these cows being thrown into the truck, so one of the investigators followed the truck, and of course, shocker, it showed up at a veal place. So I just wanted to clarify that this is not an isolated incident. This is what, ha what happens in the dairy industry. It's standard practice to send male baby cows to be killed in this industry because they're not going to offer monetary value for them. So they just kill them. And it's like the female cows in the dairy industry have to be artificially inseminated. So they'll do that. The cow will go through her nine month pregnancy. And then if she has a male baby, then he's sent to be killed. And then if it's a female, then she goes into the same system. So she's artificially inseminated. She has her babies taken away from her. And once she doesn't produce enough milk anymore, she's considered spent and is sent to the slaughterhouse to for meat that ends up in things like dog food. And it's just like, this is totally unnecessary, you know? And these are some of the most maternal creatures out there. So what that means is that they form really strong bonds with their family. And so what happens is when these babies are ripped away from their mothers, the mothers will bellow out for days in search of their babies. And it's absolutely freaking heartbreaking. And it's just like, if we don't wanna watch this happen, if we don't want to see it, if it devastates us when these investigations come out, then stop paying for it to happen because this is the dairy industry in general. This is not just Fair Oaks Farm. This is dairy. So if you're eating cheese or sour cream or if you're buying big goodies that have any dairy in it whatsoever, it doesn't matter. You're still contributing to the industry. You know, and I, I know so many vegetarians and I'm like... I was vegetarian for seven years and I get it, you know, like I thought I wasn't hurting animals, but then once I found out what was happening, I was like, wow, I was consuming so much cheese and other dairy products that I was probably doing more harm to these animals by upping my dairy intake. And it's like, just cut it out already because you have a choice and they don't. You know, so if you've been waiting for a time, if you think that you want to go vegan, but it's been really tricky and you don't know how to do it, please just send me a message. I would love to help you. And, you know, you have a choice and these animals don't. So please just stop paying for them to be abused already.